say if I can do it, you can do it too. Welcome to our channel. I'm Sarah and I'm Jamie and we just bought our very first house But as you guys will see it needs a lot of work. We have big plans, but a pretty small budget So that means we have to do everything ourselves things that we've never done before because we've never owned a house and it should be pretty fun <laughs> Quick background info for you guys It is a four level back split with four bedrooms and two baths two of which are in an in-law suite that we don't want. So we're gonna be getting rid of that along with all of the floors because the house kind of had a smell. Not all houses are move-in ready. Some of them are reno ready. <laughs> so let's go. So now that we have taken all of our floors and no longer have any floors, we need to go and uh, actually look for the flooring that we want. We're going to go to Home Depot to look at some hardwood samples because we decided hardwood was what we wanted. Yeah. Yeah. I like the darker hardwood stuff. So dark wood shows all of the dust and dirt and we have dogs that shed a lot. So all of that dog hair is just not fun. So I want a lighter hardwood. As long as we make it to a gas station, because otherwise then we ain't getting no hardwood. Can we get ice caps? <laughs> yes. Beep. Can I please? I don't know if we're gonna leave it in the gas station. Oh, there's an open house. Two to four. We can hit that up on the way home. Let's buy another one. Another one that's reno ready. We ended up settling on this medium tone that was in between the dark and lighter wood, so we compromised and it was on sale, so everyone wins. Except I've never laid hardwood before and she expects me to lay over 2,000 square feet. Okay, well I tried to do it myself and that did not turn out the greatest, so. That's how it gets broken. This isn't fun this way, I don't like it. It was. Jamie, I messed up. That's what you don't want to do. Because then it gets bad. Oh. Yep. Yeah. And that's why I have Jamie. Alright guys, so now it's time for one of my favorite parts, which would be furniture shopping. But before I, I get any furniture for a room, my favorite thing to do is to create an actual layout. It helps me figure out where I'd want the furniture. So for us, a really important thing in this room is Jamie's fish tank, which I drew out here all cute. And now, this is a really massive fish tank. Once you set it up, it's staying there. We're gonna have two accent chairs. I'm bending it. We're gonna put one in each corner. This way we're keeping the flow of the room from the dining room to the hallway. It's easy to walk through. This bay window, I hate it. I don't like it at all. Uh, just, just the way it's offset. So Jamie came up with a really great idea that maybe we'll build a bench in here and it will serve as extra storage, put a little cushion on top, the dogs can sit on it and it can serve as an extra seat for our guests. Throw an area rug and some accessories in it and I think it'll look really good. So I have made the most amazing discovery ever. Leon's has an as is section that they put like discontinued items or things that people return that they then mark down to like 70% off and it's like absolutely amazing. So you get these really awesome pieces of furniture for like no money that normal people like us couldn't afford. I mean, a bonus is that like they're literally like, right down the street from us. So I can go like all the time. I just pop in, it's very hit or miss. So like you're coming home from work, you're going grocery shopping, you just stop by the store, take a look, see around and like sometimes you end up buying a couch. I think she's bought enough furniture that we've uh, already received two thank you cards. I am glad that they appreciate my business.
Hey guys, so sorry to do this to you guys vlog style, but I don't have like a camera crew or anything that follows us around all the time. And Milo was feeling needy, so he's also going to be in this video. Basically so far, I have bought a couch from Leon's, as well as a chair that was way too massive for my initial floor plan. Uh, I didn't measure, so that's kind of my fault. I knew it would fit somewhere. But Jamie figured we could just put it in the bay window, so Jamie doesn't have to build a bench anymore. And, but now I still need two more accent chairs. They have to match because I can't have three non-matching accent chairs. So we'll see how that goes. So you guys have probably seen some of the furniture we've collected so far, and it's all really awesome, but it's all kind of a little formal-ish. Things we already had from our old apartment are these awesome pillows here. And you might think this is gonna look really weird. We have some really formal pieces, but I think it's gonna look really awesome. I think it's gonna be a great mix between the two. So this is where we're sort of getting our color palette from here. My mother's godfather collected all these awesome paintings. We've got this beautiful native painting. It has that same like bluey turquoise color in it that the pillows do. It's gonna be an awesome statement piece in the room. I think it's gonna really make it just something special. And then a couple other accent pieces. It's gonna really bring the whole room together because that accessories, rooms don't look finished. It was interesting designing the living room because we didn't really know what we were gonna do because we just kind of had to like get hit and miss stuff as we were going. And then I think it all just kind of worked out really well. Yeah. It is actually insane how cheap some of these prices are. Like those chairs were $500 each and they were about $100 each. Because the arm was broken off. Yeah, but you can fix that. I'm actually surprised at how well it all turned out. Thank you. Well, you've never really designed anything before, so... That's true. I've never designed anything before. I'm just an avid HGTV watcher, love the YouTube design shows, and Jamie, exact same thing here. We're yeah. literally just sort of like learning as we go and hoping for the best. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe and like the video. There is so much more to come, guys. We're gonna eventually tackle every single room in this house, and we wanna bring you along for the ride. Thanks for watching. Yeah! Woo!